It was 2022 and we really wanted to do something that just felt like old MFP back in community together, but we knew that it had to be something outside. And Michelle and I are on a women's Facebook group. We had never met, but I learned that her boyfriend is Isaiah, who's a professional skater. So I reached out to her and I just said, I'm sure it's a long shot, but do you think Isaiah would ever do a skate event with us for Black History Month? And five seconds later, Michelle wrote back, yes, exclamation point, exclamation point. So in February of 2022 was the inaugural Black History Month skate event. And when we approached Isaiah and Michelle again this year to ask if they would consider doing the event, they doubled down and said that they wanted to make this an annual event with My Friend's Place. Michelle immediately activated their community. All of these corporate partners came on board to donate obviously boards, but also other gear and clothing for the young people. This is something that they do so we can come together as a community and spend some good quality time and skate. I think for some people, a skate event for young people experiencing homelessness could seem a little unconventional, but it's also about the experience of taking appropriate and healthy risks in a fun and supported environment. It's also about play, and My Friend's Place believes strongly that play is how we heal. Not necessarily everybody is a skater, but everybody's still skating and having a good time, so that's cool. Nobody feels alone, because when you might not have a place to stay, you're homeless or you don't got food or clothes, you're just out there and people are looking at you like you don't exist. So then when you come to MFP, I feel like everybody feels like there's no judgment and we're pushing forward for the future. My Friends Place serves 40% black youth. So especially for our Black History Month celebration, we know that representation matters. And Isaiah's investment in our young people reminds them of their own capabilities. I'm inspired by Isaiah. I love the way that he moves about life. I'm like, wow, I don't have to look too far to see someone like me be successful. I could see a lot of qualities in him within myself. We really can't thank Isaiah and Michelle enough for making this day happen and for just being such advocates and ambassadors for the young people that we serve. Here.